Hello everyone, it's Michelle. Today I'm continuing with the home makeover series. Today I'm going to show you how to dress your kitchen window without having to buy those cafe curtains. So let's go ahead and jump right on in. So the first thing I'm using are two tassels and they are 14 inches. Um, the drop on this is 14 inches. So that's really important so that because it's going to be holding up the curtains. And then of course your curtain rod. You can use a tension rod if you're in between two cabinets. And then for me, the important thing is to use a rod pocket curtain. I have never tried it with a grommet, but I know that it always comes out good with a rod pocket curtain. So this is the one I'm using, but you can use any one you want. Um, I'm going to just slip the curtain rod inside before I put it up on the window. And just make sure that your curtain rod is wide enough to fill that gap in between your two curtain, your two cabinets in your kitchen or just above the window in your kit in your kitchen. Then I'm going to slide on the tassels on either side of the curtains and then I'll adjust it at when I put it up on the window. These are 96 by 52 curtains, so they're 52 inches wide and 96 inches long. So you need a lot of fabric to be able to do this. So I'm just going to put it down on the floor and just fold the fabric over. Um, I'm just taking like about 10 inches at a time and doing like a pinch pleat all the way up until I get to about 14 inches from the top. And then I'm just pulling over the tassels on either side. Really simple, straightforward. And you can do this with any curtain that you already have. As long as it's a rod pocket and it's about 96 inches. So if you love home decor, decorating, or DIYs, go ahead and click that subscribe button so you don't miss out on my home makeover series. So guys, currently, what kind of window dressing do you have in your kitchen? I know a lot of people do the cafe curtains, which are those kind of shorter curtains that kind of cut the window in half. Um, some people don't do anything at all. Let's get the conversation started in the comments on what you've done in your kitchen, just to give everybody ideas on what to do. I do feel like when you put curtains in a kitchen or any room, really, it gives it kind of like that softness. It kind of gives it that finishing touch. So let me know in the comments what you've done or if you'll try this um, since you just re need really just a regular one panel curtain in order to do this. Um, so yeah, let's get that conversation started. Guys, I have a lot of pictures and some more video to go, but I'm not going to talk through it. If you have any questions about anything that you see in the video, as always, let me know in the comments and I will get back with you.
Okay, thanks a lot for watching the video today and thanks for following the home decor series that I have going on and I will see you in the next one. Take care of yourself.